Hello everybody, welcome to Breaking the Make. Today I'm going to show you how to make this a DIY boo -boo 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 woven scarf. Out of the denim yarn that we made last week, I made this beautiful scarf. It's short so I can either, I can stick a button here or I can use a pin from my pin collection and keep it pinned shut or I just looped it around itself and did that. I like that too. Super cute and super fun. I'll show you how to do it. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna take our cardboard and we're gonna mark, we're gonna nip into here about half an inch apart and we'll go about as wide as I wanted it. It was like five inches. And I'm gonna start drawing my half inch marks with my clear grid ruler so I can make sure I'm super even. I'm gonna do it for six inches. This is my last one. Here's my grid. I'm gonna do the same thing on the other side of the cardboard, but I have to make sure that the marks are parallel. Yikes. Wish me luck. The way you do that is measure from the side where, I, where you started. So I started five inches from this edge. Come in and ah, cut these. I have sissy fingers, so I can't actually like cut it. Scissors are weak. I've got all my cuts done, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to start threading my warp along the cardboard. I want about five inches to hang off for fringe. I'm just going to tie a knot so it's about five inches. I'm going to hook it into the cardboard, just like that. I'm going to pull it taut and I'm going to do the same thing on the other side. Pull on it a little, tie a knot here, and hook it into this slot. I'm gonna keep tying knots and keep warping my loom. Ooh, I need to cut these slits deeper. I'm struggling pretty hard. I think I need to cut the slits deeper and that'll solve some of my troubles. Now that I've cut the slits deeper, it's going so much faster. Cut your slits pretty deep, like an inch. I balled up my sari yarn so it's easier to pass through. I didn't make my balls too big. Now I'm gonna start weaving. It's just under, over, under, over, just a simple plain weave. And now we're just gonna keep building on. So I was under, now I go over, and I go under this one. Whew, it's gonna be tricky, I believe in you. Don't pull this too tight, otherwise it'll bow. So you wanna kinda smoosh it in there nice. I finished my weaving. I'm gonna go ahead and pull it off the loom. I'm gonna weave in my ends, and then I'm gonna stitch on my, my end pieces so they stay in the weaving and don't slowly slide out because it's so loosely woven. I don't want my thing to unravel. This side was a little easier to pop off. There, this. And now I'm going to tie a knot. I'm just weaving my ends back in through the work behind the other stitches. Following along exactly where I was, but on the back. There. And then I'll cut this off later. And there! It's done! If you like this video, give it a thumbs up and please subscribe for more upcycle and recycle DIYs. We'll see you next week. Bye. Okay.